Winter officially starts six weeks from tomorrow. Storm 5 meteorologist Bree Smith is taking an in-depth look at what we can expect this winter. To get an idea of what winter may bring the mid-state this season, we actually have to start with the Pacific Ocean, specifically the temperatures of the ocean water near the equator. So for the second year in a row, ocean temperatures in the equatorial Pacific are below normal. That's what this light blue color shows you. This is a climate pattern known as La Nina, and it's expected to be in place through early spring. Now, when La Nina is in place, it shifts the track of the jet stream all across the globe and the jet stream has a big influence on what kind of winter we're gonna get. Now for the US, it causes the jet stream to shift further to the north in the Pacific Northwest and not dive as far south across the southeast. This is important because the jet stream is a barrier and most of the cold air stays locked north of it. So if the jet stream is parked just north of us, it sets the stage for a warmer winter, which doesn't bode well for our winter weather lovers. Now coming up tomorrow night, I'm gonna take a deep dive into just how much snow we could see this season. And on Wednesday, we're gonna take a very important close look at what it means for your severe weather chances and what you can do to be prepared.